We recently stayed at the Walter J. Hayes State Park, which is in Michigan's Irish Shows area, south of Jackson, Michigan. This is one of the older state parks in Michigan, and it celebrated its 100th birthday this year. And this is our camping spot at Hayes State Park, spot 79. And this one's kind of unique because on the curbside, where you normally have your fire pit and stuff, it's over here. But the spot goes all the way out to that point. So, big spot, but it's kind of convoluted a little bit. One thing that's unusual about this campground as far as the Michigan park systems is that all the sites are paved. And with most Michigan parks, they're not. They're just dirt. However, all these sites are electricity only, and that's pretty typical of Michigan parks. You know, 100 years ago, people had tents. They didn't have 40-foot RVs. So it's taken some time, but Michigan state parks seem like they're trying to accommodate to the larger rigs. And not all of these spots are level in this campground, so when you make a reservation, make sure and look for a level site. We camped here once about 30 years ago, and we just had a tent trailer. And I don't remember what spot it was, but I do remember that it wasn't level. And I didn't have enough blocks or wood to make the trailer level. I'm a little resourceful, so what I actually did is I took the spare tire off the trailer, then laid the spare tire on the ground, backed over it with a trailer with one wheel, and that actually leveled the trailer. And we're at the beach at Wampler's Lake, which is part of the Hayes State Park, and it is actually across the highway from the campground itself. So we plan on coming here and we'll just bring a picnic lunch and stuff and stay for the afternoon. There's a bathhouse here so you can change. The amenities of the Irish Hills area are a couple spots that you need to visit. The first one is the McCullough's Meat Packing Plant. And the meat packer sells directly to the customer so they can offer some very attractive pricing. Actually, people come from out of state even to shop here. And it's located about six miles from the campground on Briggs Highway, which is actually a dirt road. And here are the results of our shopping trip to McCullough's. We have two pounds of T-bone, five forty-nine a pound. Can you believe that? Eleven dollars and twenty cents. And we also have two pounds of ribeye, which is six forty-nine a pound for twelve dollars and sixty-six cents. And about five miles from Hayes State Park is the Michigan International Speedway. They hold a couple NASCAR races every year, and also a big event called Faster Horses which is a weekend concert. So there are times of the year when Hayes is going to be full and it's going to be full six months ahead. So you need to get reservations in if you're going to be there those weekends. And as well, there's probably more lakes in this area per square mile than any other area in Michigan. So there's many, many boating opportunities if you have a boat.